What is up, Internet? How are your faces? It's, um, it's Tuesday afternoon. Um, I'll get you caught up in just a second um, on what's happened over the past, like, 36 hours-ish or whatever. I think that's right. Whatever. I don't know. Um, right now, there's a uh, pep rally about to happen. One of those holly preps, peps or whatever. Joanne's going to march down the hall. Um, they're already down there. They should be starting any second now, so let's just go check that out, shall we? So, funny story. I ended up missing it. It's like got in the hallway and they were already right there so I didn't have time to like pull this thing out or whatever. Oops. Sorry. My bad. I would you caught up in a second. I'm just putting a schedule together for the rest of the day and uh yeah just kind of figuring out what the rest of this week looks like because once again it's insane. Um I'll check in a bit. All right. As you've probably noticed I'm wearing a different shirt um and that is because uh the last time you saw me was was Tuesday, like afternoonish or whatever. It is now Friday afternoon. So what I was going to tell you Tuesday night that I guess now I have to tell you now, I guess, or whatever, um, it's kind of exactly what ended up happening. The next couple of weeks, like literally up until spring break, are like insanely busy. But yeah, they're between like concerts and covering for my boss and just doing a whole bunch of general like-ish or whatever. I have no time, genuinely like none or whatever. So for a little bit, these uh, these vlogs are essentially going to be kind of like, you know, week long or whatever, like week long events. Yep, so we had that indoor rehearsal like that night after that or whatever, and it was good. It was fine, from my perspective at least. We got, didn't get a, like, a whole lot done theoretically, but we cleaned like parts of the show that were like new, new to us and that kind of like needed to be touched because you know, they were, there, they were quite frankly pretty difficult. So yeah, got a fair amount done on our end. Um, after that, I think I just went home and genuinely like passed out or whatever. Because then the next day, Wednesday, oh boy, that was a goddamn marathon. Started teaching at seven that morning. Uh, sectional at one junior high, private lesson at the same junior high. Um, teaching a class at the other junior high and then I went back to the high school for a little bit to kind of like help prepare some stuff and like talk through some things or whatever and then um, went to sorry and then went back to that other junior high to um, you know get <laughs> to actually no, another class another class over there and then I had to rush back to the high school to teach another private lesson over there. Uh, at that point, I was able to kind of head home, like, or, or whatever, because we didn't have rehearsal that night. And um, and quite honestly, like, they could tell that the directors, the directors could tell that I was exhausted, so they just like let me go. They were like, "Yeah, no, you're good. You're fine. You don't have to like keep staying here or, or whatever." I passed out so early that night, genuinely like couldn't do it anymore, but had to wake up early the next morning because uh, starting Thursday, all of the directors, not even just my boss, everyone was gone for uh, TMEA, the Texas Music Education Association, um, their conferences this week. Um, it technically started Wednesday, but you know, kind of similar to PASIC, uh, no one really cares about that first day. So yeah, they all left like Wednesday night so that they could uh, have start their fun on Thursday. So yeah, they've been gone for two days. Um, and that's pretty much it. Thursday, I like just covered as many, many classes as I could. Um, stayed after school to you know facilitate people's individual like practice stuff or whatever. Today, today was a pretty easy day. Today was just a half day, so I didn't go in for classes because, uh, well, each class period was only 20 minutes, and they were running like all the drills. They had, like fire drill, active shooter drill, tornado drill, like all that fun stuff or whatever. Um, so essentially, no one would have gotten anything done today. So I didn't go in. Monday, Monday's a day off from school for us, and I'm planning on doing nothing. And and here's the thing, I, 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 don't, I don't mean like that typical, just like, yeah, just like, if I don't really get anything done, if I send up playing a bad spot, it's like, no, I'm making an active plan to like shut off the phone and just like not do anything for a day because I need it. Like desperately, 100% need it. Cool, didn't expect to talk that long. I'm already at the bank, so I need to go deposit my money now. So, uh see you in just one second and we're back currently driving through the parking lot of walmart um yeah just pretty much just ran or whatever to get a couple of extra things or whatever now heading back to my apartment i think
think I'll have just enough time when I get back to like call like the loan offices before they close or whatever because I need to get that done. And then I'm honestly debating whether or not I want to go into Houston tonight. Not not for what you think. I, again, I, I think I want to like start like driving Uber like for for real tonight. I've been doing like sporadically like on and off. Um, or whatever, but I really want to get into like kind of like a regular like routine with it or whatever, so I can actually like make money off of it or whatever. And I kind of want to go like tonight. I have just enough time that I can like get into Houston right in time for everyone to like be getting out of work and like want to go back to wherever the hell they're going or whatever, so I can be a part of that crowd. On the other hand, I'm still really, really, really exhausted, and um, and and tonight's kind of. Because I'm planning on doing nothing on Monday, tonight's kind of my last night to get a whole lot of kind of like logistical stuff done because tomorrow there's a parade in the morning. I'm still debating whether or not I'm like going to said parade, but then there's a rehearsal. I'm gonna drive to Austin and then I'm gonna be there all day Sunday, like getting stuff done or whatever. So yeah, I don't I don't know. Um, I guess what I'm thinking is that I can always I don't know, I can always drive, but I only have like so much time to get everything done I need to for next week, especially if I am going to take Monday off or whatever. So maybe I just like wait a day. Besides, I don't want a random Friday to be like the first day that I'm like, again, driving around, like getting a whole bunch of like, whatever, like, like sort of business for Uber or whatever. I'm sorry, I'm not good at English right now <laughs> because you all know how Friday night goes. Don't deny it. You were all in college once. You know. Um, so yeah. Um, actually, the more I talk about it out loud, the more I think I'm just going to stay in tonight. Get some stuff done. Um, yeah, I think that would be the best use of my time and honestly of my money because I just filled up our gas and I really want to try to make this tank last through like through the weekend at least or whatever well, without drive to Austin or whatever. Um, next week is like borderline insane anyway so so you know what yeah let's let's take tonight get stuff done i can always start driving uber next week or on monday because again monday's the day after school i can literally drive around houston all day hey we'll see what happens stay tuned but yeah i'm just uh on my way home now then i guess where i'm just gonna get a whole lot done and not really not really worry about going out tonight. Thank God, because I'm literally dead from the past two weeks, and we got three more, three, th wait, actually, wait, no, two. Two more to go before spring break. Praise Jesus. <laughs> we're so close, guys. We are so close to actually having, like, something resembling a break, and, oh, God, okay, all right. <laughs> Ket catch up in a second. So I was literally so tired that I fell asleep immediately upon getting home. Oops, my bad. That means I haven't called um, the loan company and it's like eight at night, so I don't know if I'd be successful in that. I figure, you know what? After I finish this, I'm gonna call. Um, we'll see what happens there. Um, yeah, pause please. So it turns out that they uh, closed at nine Eastern Standard Time. I neglected to see the Eastern Standard Time thing, and so at the clock, saw it was like eight something or whatever, I thought, oh, perfect, they're still open, so I tried to call, and yeah, that, yeah, sent me into a little bit of a spiral, a bit, or whatever, like, only a little mini one, though, enough of one that even though I was going to actually cook tonight, um, that didn't happen anymore, so yeah, that's my dinner for the third night in a row. I'm so healthy, guys. But before I do that, though, um, as I was leaving to go get that, I noticed that there is a package from home um sitting on my doorstep i'm pretty sure i know what it is because you know yesterday yesterday was valentine's day by the way so happy valentine's day for all of you like people with love in your lives or whatever um i'm pretty sure i know what it is um i'm pretty sure it's from my mom so i'm gonna pop this open we're gonna see what's what and uh yeah stay tuned <laughs> so that was friday night so you can probably tell from the different attire um, it is a different day entirely. In fact, again, it was Friday night. It's now Monday night. In fact, very, very, very late Monday night. And I'm just here just trying to get some laundry done and fold it or whatever before I go to bed um, because I stayed up way too late and I needed to get this done. And yeah, to catch you up 
on what happened that box I was opening Friday night it was indeed for my mom and it was indeed chocolate chip cookies um, I was literally like overcome with excitement at seeing that which is why I didn't you know record it at all but yeah they were delicious and they are all gone by now so that's cool that's fun Saturday was kind of a rough day to be 100% honest um, the band had a parade in the morning I did not go to that because I didn't have to and quite frankly I was like exhausted from everything else I had to do with the band or whatever so I didn't go and then after that we had indoor rehearsal and uh, let's just say most of the kids didn't want to be there because of said parade in the morning um, they were all kind of like whatever and um, I drove to Austin after that at which point we had a pretty 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 good I would I would say Sunday um, just rehearsing with with them or whatever and dealing with logistics for Saturday because Saturday is Rhythmic Forces first show up in Dallas so that should be fun that should be entertaining or whatever all of which led to today um, today was Monday and a day off from school because it's President's Day um, I know that like whether we get today off is a little bit of kind of a um, a what because I know that there were many college kids that I teach over my course I did not have today off um, and I was kind of here sitting here just like sorry I work for a school district that believes in presidents I don't know what to tell you I got today off slept in um, didn't really do a whole ton of work um, just kind of like the bare minimum stuff that needed to get done today um, or whatever um, simply because you know I've been working my tail off for the past couple of weeks in between covering for my boss and like working with like a whole bunch of other different groups or whatever but yeah um yeah so today was good today was fine today was good I'm gonna end the vlog here because again I kind of want to keep to my whole like one week per vlog like thing or whatever which is literally how February is going to have to work unfortunately for the moment because there's so much happening in this coming week isn't any better in that regard. Um, I will talk about this next week. It's kind of because I really just kind of want to get this done and like go to bed or whatever. Um, yeah, in the next vlog, I'll talk about what this upcoming week entails because it be a lot and I'm probably going to be super duper duper stressed by the end of it. But what else is new? Here's my thing. Here's my thoughts. I don't really understand why, you know, Valentine's Day, like the holiday of love or whatever, which, you know, happened last week. Um, I don't know why it's in February because so far over the course of, you know, my life, I think I can say with like very little hesitation that February as a month just sucks. Like completely and totally awful. You're always stressed, always like in the doldrums of winter. And here's the thing, like I haven't even been hit by that that bad because again, I'm in Texas. Like their idea of cold down here is like 60 something or whatever literally we had rehearsal outside on Saturday and they're all saying there's like it's cold and it was 65 degrees I had to pull up my phone and show them that it was 20 degrees in Iowa City um, so they would just quite frankly like shut up but yeah I can only imagine what my mental state would be like right now if I was like in an actually cold part of the country or whatever like I don't know I'm just I'm I don't know, February just has never been a good month for me simply because of, you know, stress and like winter bull crap or whatever. Um, yeah, so I'm not entirely sure why the love holiday is starting that month. Um, I don't know. No idea. Just my two cents. That's how I see it. Cool. I'm going to end the vlog here because I'm loopy and I really just want to focus on just getting this done and going the F to bed because I'm exhausted. I'm really... Sorry that the vlogs still aren't up to date. Um, again, life has been absolutely like batshit insane. But I promise I'm working on it. I'm going to try to to get it sometime by the beginning of the month or whatever. And if that doesn't work, then spring break is actually coming up pretty soon. So eventually, eventually it'll happen. But I need to get through the next two weeks first. Two weeks till spring break. So damn close. All right. Uh, wish me luck. Um, I'm going to finish this up. Head to bed. I'm sorry that these vlogs have been like so scatterbrained and like whatever. Um, that's going to get fixed soon. Until next time. Okay, see ya.